Welcome to how to select the right satellite phone network in Australia, the speed dating way. In this video and in less than three minutes, just like speed dating, I want to inform you of the satellite phone networks that are available across the country and help you choose which is right for you. Now let's first understand that most people buy a satellite phone for safety and support in case of an injury, a breakdown, and to notify others of their traveling progress. So when you need it, you want it to work and not have to drive the extra kilometers in that broken down vehicle or scale a mountain with a broken leg to get the signal to make that call. Your sat phone purchase needs to match your purpose. So I've got three minutes to sort this out. Let's go. There are three satellite phone providers in Australia, that being Thraya, Imarsat and Iridium. And there are two types of satellite systems, that being geostationary, which don't move, and orbiting. Thraya operate a geostationary network with one satellite that serves Australia, which sits in the west northwestern sky above Singapore. The east coast of Australia is the furthest distance from this satellite, and from Brisbane to Tasmania, only averages an elevation of about 22 degrees, which is very low. Hills and valleys will present coverage challenges to the southeastern regions of Australia and Tasmania. However, as you move to the west, the coverage will improve considerably. Satellite phones operate similar to that of those old Nokia phones we used to love. A little like going back in time. Or well, maybe not that far back. If there's a funky feature that these phones offer, other than voice calls and sending SMS messages, it's the ability to send their location coordinates to associates and loved ones so they can track your travels with applications like Google Maps. The Thraya phones are the XT Lite, the XT Pro, and the satellite to mobile phone Wi-Fi hotspot that Thraya Sats leave. Imarsat operate the other geostationary network with one satellite that serves Australia, which sits in the northern sky above Papua New Guinea. Perth and Hobart are the furthest distances from this satellite with elevations of 42 and 53 degrees respectively. This is like double the elevation provided by the Thraya network at its furthest points. Due to this satellite being more overhead to Australia, our customers' feedback is that the Imarsat coverage is good across Australia, including Tasmania. Imarsat only has one phone available, which is the iSat Phone 2. Now we move to the Iridium orbiting satellite network. Unlike its competitors, Iridium operates a constellation of 66 low Earth orbiting satellites. They are like everywhere. Travelling at speeds of 27,000 kilometres per hour, this connected mesh of satellites to do, can do a complete orbit of the Earth in around 100 minutes. No need to locate a fixed satellite with Iridium, just point the phone antenna to the sky and you're good to go. The Iridium phones are the 9555, the 9575 Extreme, and the satellite to mobile phone Wi-Fi hotspot, the Iridium Go. So there's a little homework to do as the satellite phone network offerings differ across the Australian mainland and Tasmania. At Satellite Phone Warehouse, we share the facts and our customers' experience and feedback to give you a better deal that matches your purpose and budget. Now please, click on the like, make a comment, ask a question, share it with your mates, and jump on our website, satellitephonewarehouse.com.au for all things satellite phones, and I'll see you on the next one. Is it three minutes yet? <laughs>